Hello friends, welcome back to our channel and thanks for subscribing. In today's video, I am going to introduce you all with one of the most efficient and more secure remote meeting and conferencing application which is widely used by the organizations. Yes friend, it is Cisco Webex Meetings. You can download it from www.webex.co.in though it has an option called web application but I suggest to download it for more features. Features like quick meeting setup, easy recording of meeting, yes friends very easy to record the meeting, multiple options to share the screen applications, more control over the participants because of the security reasons this application has given more controls over the participants of the meeting and more secure because it is from the Cisco which is world's number one company in the field of networking and security and many more. So friends let's explore this Webex. Let's open the Cisco Webex website with the URL webex.co.in. Now as soon as you open it there are major two options available on the site which is quite highlighted than the other option that is host and join. But before you click anywhere you need to register yourself with the Cisco Webex site. So just scroll down and here you can see it is written sign up now it's a free. Yes friend Cisco Webex is free just click over here and sign up with your proper details. As soon as you click here it will give you an option where you can provide your email address and you can register yourself. But remember one thing that if you are joining the meeting you need not to register for Cisco Webex. Registration is only required for the host of the meeting. I hope you register yourself on the Webex site with the email address. Remember friends there is no need of educational email or any other organizational email id is required. You can register yourself with any email address but it must be a valid email address because to setting up the password the instruction will be given by the Cisco Webex on that email only. So after registration let's try to sign in with that particular details. I am using my uh, registered email address. Now as soon as you sign up and you have seen that it is a hardly two minute process to sign up with the Cisco Webex meetings. Now based on the details you have provided that is username and password it is taking the name of your meeting room. So you can see I have provided GenX solution so here it is in GenX solution and the name is given as a personal room. There are actually two options to work with the Cisco Webex. One is the desktop app, other one is the web app. Majority of the time web app is used for some sort of settings only which will be directly affected in your desktop app. And in desktop app we are having more options than the web app. So before we go ahead with the desktop app, let's see some of the general settings into the web app. So here it is uh, your name GS Gen GenX Solutions you can change your uh, uh, logo or you can change your picture. You can click on the start meeting you can schedule a meeting all these options are nowadays most common so I am not going into that deep detail. Uh, on the left hand side we are having lots of options the very first one is the meetings. If you click on the meetings it will show you some more options and the uh, availability available with this that is the my meeting and the time duration you can see all the uh, details about your meetings a kind of uh, archive kind of uh, history or something like that which you can show here uh, dates and all that you can filter out next you go to the recording as I told you that Cisco Webex allows you very easy way to check for the uh, or to record the meeting. So all the details will be available here again you can see this some of the options or the filters we have with the recording. We will see that later on right now we are not going uh, for the other options because we don't have any recording. 
the preferences if you click the preferences here you can see more options the very first one is the general option where you can change the timing right now it is uh, Singapore we need to select it Chennai Kolkata Mumbai our regular time uh, at the bottom uh, you can click on the save if you wish to sign in with other accounts you can select the Google Facebook other accounts also but friends as a security measures nowadays I suggest not to enter more details in such kind of application though Cisco Webex is one of the highest secure web application we should not provide each and every detail which are not required now if you go into the my personal room this is the best place worst option where you can change the name of your meetings and all that uh, here whatever name you wish you can set it I am setting ABC just for your reference so uh, ABC meeting room meeting room then uh, personal room link this link is given which is not editable so it is a permanent link but this pin number is editable one can easily change this pin number and uh, uh, as it is not allowing any kind of sequence you need to give some random numbers then and then it will accept it so that is a kind of security by default provided by Cisco Webex after this automatic lock automatically lock my room after 10 minutes so that no one can interrupt you after 10 minutes so it is again a kind of security in the initial 10 minutes you are allowing all the participants to join your meeting and some sort of notification by which you can get the email so if you are doing some changes make sure you save it to applicable into your meeting then audio and video it will ask you for the audio and video at the time when you start the webex but though i have already apply uh, allowed setting from this option also you can see the audio video settings and all that which one you want to use we do not have the wipe setting as of now so we are going with the webex audio only and some sort of names and all that uh, call me numbers are available but don't go as of now it is again if we are not that much familiar then it will create a security loop video settings also we are not touching then go for the scheduling if i want to schedule something i can schedule the meeting from the main home menu or home page and if i enable this it will send a uh, copy of the email to me and the last one is the recording which type of recording you wish or especially what type of content you want in your recording so some of the options are available like the video thumbnails view uh, active speaker view and uh, content view only so accordingly you can save the details and you can go ahead so this is the preference part next one is the insight please make sure whatever settings you are doing in your particular uh, preferences are proper otherwise it will create an issues right as of now we do not have any meeting or we have not created any meeting so insights are blank but here you can see all the information about meetings you have hosted will be appear here or kind of history who has joined and how many participants were there and all the details were available in this insights so friends from here you can compare your different meetings that how many participants have joined and what are the uh, status of your meetings in the past as well as the present and after that you have the download support and feedback which are as of now not required so these are some of the uh, majority of the settings for the Cisco Webex and you can see it is very very easy to set up the particular meeting after that just uh, you start click on the start meeting I have already downloaded the desktop app and I have selected that desktop app otherwise if you go ahead with the U web app it will start with the web app choice is your you can select anything more on this detail we will see into the other videos so thank you friends for connecting with us i hope you like the videos uh, you will share the videos and you will not forget to subscribe the channels keep stay with us you will definitely get some good videos and some secure informations thank you